some of the best works from my AI community. Hello, my friends, how are you doing? You are the best AI community out there in the whole landscape. And once in a while, I do a challenge in my Facebook group for the new banner image. And this time we had so amazing images. I just have to share them with you. Let's get started. Here is the first image and we had so many amazing entries that I had to sort out some of them. Also on the top left, you will always see the name of the artist. I have to go a little bit quick because it's almost 50 entries I want to show you here this one is a really beautiful composition off center which makes it special it's kind of cyborg look this next one might be mid journey because of the dynamic of the look has a very nice GoPro style I love everything about this image here we have a very nice car concept in a landscape I love how detailed the car is and also how the composition looks really amazing in the next one again we have this kind of off center center face. I love the color composition, this kind of gold and blue, but also this network that's radiating out of the eyes like a matrix, like a cosmic network, stuff like that. There's a story happening here. Next, we have this beautiful kind of tilt shift image of an astronaut in a mushroom forest. And you see how big the variety is of different images created here. This is really beautiful, very realistic also. Next, we have one from our amazing mod, Shannon Hill. Hilson and she is doing a very cool image here where the hair is blending into a lot of different creatures here. This might even be underwater. There's a lot to unpack here, a lot of different details to find. Very beautiful, also very nice composition. Next one, we have this, which reminds me of the day of the death. It's skulls, but it's very happy, very colorful. Again, I love the choice of colors, the composition here that's happening and the amazing different idea in this image. Here we have one from Adobe Firefly, different style. You can directly see that this looks different from the other images, but I feel like it looks very nice. It has very nice elements to it and a very cool expression. This one is really interesting. I think it was afterwards edited to be mirrored on both sides because the symmetry is not just in the composition, but in every minute detail. I love the color choice here, black and red, and also the background that might be organic or might be stone. I'm not quite sure. And on the outside, you have these little planets floating around. So there's a lot of story going on in this image. Here we have a very nice landscape and this user sent in multiple ones. So this is just one of them. What I like here very much is the reflection is very accurate to what we see above. So this is a very nice example of that. And also it looks like a very nice ski resort I would love to visit. Here we have one that is in a very different artistic style showing the range of my community of the different things they try. I love the combination here of this very classic style, but then also drifting, melting into an abstract, modern, expressive style. Very cool idea, also interesting ratio. Here we have a very nice image, kind of a cyborg creature split up in three different colors. I love the dramatic light on the right side, only on the most important parts of the face in yellow. Then we have this blue, cold expression on the face. But then also we have this warm violet light happening in these kind of cables in this kind of computer in the hair, basically, that has the same color as the background, connecting it to the world behind it. I can really see this being a cover for a sci-fi novel. Next, we have this really beautiful image here. I love how the light is coming from behind through the flowers. We have a very nice bokeh in the background with these bokeh balls and a very nice warm sunset light. Really cool here from the same artist, a very cute collection of aliens. I love how they all look. It's just very cute and very expressive. I love this composition too. Next, we have this amazing work where the hat is opening in the back, connecting the cables to all kinds of things in the background. It kind of feels like this is larger than life, super powerful cyborg story. I would love to see this as a show or as a movie. Here we have one from a user who is very focused on architecture images created with AI. And this one looks really nice. 
very cool very realistic also so he's going very far with his work on becoming better and better with these architectural concepts next we have a beautiful very detailed sci-fi city one thing i love i hope you can see that is the guys the people here sitting in the foreground where i am right now on the image looking over this nice harbor here this nice river maybe and then the illuminated city on the other side very beautiful and here a very interesting nice style very different from the artistic expression so this might be a self-trained model i'm not quite sure but i love these very many lines that create the scene but also give you a very different feel towards that scene beautiful here we have something that reminds me a lot of lord of the rings mordor these kind of rivers of lava going through the landscape beautiful style very nice and expressive next we have this amazing skeleton here with this structure around it it kind of looks alien it kind of looks like a god it's very strange i would love to know more about this story that is going on here it would be an amazing scene in a horror movie here we have another style artistic more classic again a composition between more of a classic style of painting a face and then going very abstract reminding me of Mondrian with these squares of color and the black lines so there's a lot of different interesting things going on here you can see how big the range of things is that you can do with AI next we have a very interesting entry actually two entries and this is very much in the realm of looking like analog images so I want if this is a composition of AI and actual photos or if this user has trained his own models I want to know more of what has happened in the background to create this here's a second image just to show you this kind of effect again with the flames with this kind of landscape very artistic very expressive I really like that next we have this kind of cyborg Bobby version very cool very cinematic also I think also this is the actress from the movie I love also the shininess of her body of these kind of plastic parts everything about this is really beautiful next we have this jelly which is kind of floating in a forest it might also be an underwater scene but it more looks like this jellyfish is coming out of a little river or a little pond in the middle of the forest here we have another very interesting amazing scene more of a classic style a little bit reminds me of Giger but also of this kind of surrealist art style and this kind of cosmic idea in art very interesting next we have an effect i have never seen i want to know if this was done with ai or if an ai head was then afterwards edited or applied onto a different background it looks like the background is melting into a flame it's liquid and burning at the same time like plasma really amazing here we have a very nice cocktail i hope it's a chin tonic my favorite drink although with the limes might be something different but absolutely love the atmosphere i would love to be there right now and here again we have something that is very unique in its art style i love all the details i love how this is glowing and almost burning simmering in the head of this kind of cyborg the composition is very nice there's so much motion in there how this is flowing from left to right everything about this is very dynamic and dramatic and here from the same artist a different work where the cyborg is more organic more flesh more warm looking over this landscape also encasing this landscape from all sides with this organic structure very interesting story that's happening again I could really see this being a book cover now we have here a very nice combination of a sci-fi city with a moon in the background there's different architectural styles here some are more organic some are more high-tech but also a little bit mushroom looking and then we have this river in the foreground with very classic boats so there's a lot of different styles and historical concepts going on in the same image I really love that 
Next, we have this image here. It's very abstract, but I really like images that have a lot of space for you to flow into to fill with your own thoughts. And here, of course, we have this VW, very famous uh, bus for traveling for the van life. This, these are super expensive now, but they are very, very beautiful. And here, a kind of cosmic gate, maybe a kind of hint at the multiverse. Not sure what's going on here, but it is beautiful. I love these kind of stars that are falling from the sky and this huge planet in the background. Or maybe it's another gate opening inside of that gate. You can even see a little city might be there in the background on the horizon. There's so much interesting stuff going on here. And this is again a completely different style. Look at that. Very classic. It looks like a print from the classic time where you still etched it into a metal plate or maybe it's aqua tinta. I don't think it is, but I love the style. I also love how everything here is very correct from the anatomy of the horse, how the rider sits on it. Absolutely amazing. This one is another of the examples of doing something that looks very much like a photo. Again, this really nice light from the background, classic technique to illuminate the flowers in the foreground so they kind of glow themselves. And then we have this beautiful sun dead center in the middle of the image. Really cool composition. Here we have something I've never seen in AI. And this is this kind of very dynamic perspective onto the hood of a driving car. It has so much action and movement in there. Really like it. Also, I very much like how the car and the moving background is separated, but very exactly separated. So I hope this is only AI, but it also might be editing afterwards to make it have this effect in the image. Next, we have this beautiful image of this astronaut. I'm not quite sure if he's a giant astronaut or just kneeling on the ground, but it looks very dramatic and beautiful. Here we have another style and I love these creative explosions in my community. A classic image. This is usually from anatomical lectures where you have a dead body on the table. But here we don't have that. We have a machine kind of steampunk, maybe an old computer, ancient computer that is analyzed by these wise man by these professors here. And this is another image from the same artist with kind of a workshop. This again looks kind of a steampunk thing. In the background, we see a medieval castle. So these might also be monks or it is at least in a time where this technology should not be that advanced. Really beautiful. Next again, we have from the same artist as before this very different, more surrealist abstract, expressive style, very organic and flowing. There's a lot of stuff happening here and it's so different from what you usually see with AI. Here we have another image and I love this because of the details, because of the story. You can't see the candle. I, I will bow out of the image for a second. I hope you can see the candle down there, the color scheme of the warm candle and then the kid sitting there with it even in the background, reading their comic books, the whole atmosphere, the composition, the dynamic, the expressiveness in this image is absolutely mind blowing. Next, we have here an image that is more classic for AI. But what I love here is the amount of owls we see just sitting on one tree branch. So that is really cool. And they all look so beautiful and cute. Here we have another one of these mushroom forests, very different kind of mushrooms. This looks like it's more in kind of a microscopic, very, very small world with these two astronauts exploring that. I love the color scheme also with this kind of beige and teal blue. Very interesting composition. And I love the white ratio too makes it very cinematic. Next, we have this image where I hope you can see everything with the cyborg drawing on kind of a paper that turns into kind of a cosmic dust. So much going on here, so much of a story about what we are living through right now with AI. So this is kind of a historic image, a historic moment happening in this image. Here we have another mushroom forest. This one is more dreamy, more beautiful somewhere where you want 
want to go for a picnic and explore and go for a stroll absolutely love this atmosphere here and last but not least we have the famous wave of hokusai as an ai version this looks more like a wood carving i love the colors the dynamics that are in here and also a very beautiful idea for an ai image I hope you found a lot of inspiration in this video. My mind was blown by these beautiful images. Thank you very much to everyone who submitted. Absolutely in love with each of these images. Sorry that I had to sort out a little bit some works, but man, I'm so amazed by all of this. Thank you. Subscribe if you want to see more like this and see you soon. Bye. Oh, you're still here. So uh, this is the end screen. There's other stuff you can watch like this or that's really cool. And yeah, I hope I see you soon. Uh, leave a like if you haven't yet. And well, um, yeah.